Hey, you got a little dirty there, huh? Everything all good? It's all good? Thumbs up? Let's see. Oh, this flower is... Okay, Danny, my boy. <laughs> you like the bike? Good, because Daddy lost his license to the Popo, and he's got to ride the bike now. What? Oh, look who's there. Did you guys go through a swamp? Rock, take it. Ah, where's Danny? I just see dirt <laughs> everywhere. Oh. Hey. hey. Look at Uncle Cameron. Hey, Whitey. I, I, <laughs> I got to rearrange some stuff in my dad's garage while you're here. Can you help us? Yeah. Yeah? Hey, Jenna. I'm not talking, I'm not to, talking you. to you. Why are you talking to me? Why aren't you to talking me? to me? Because you didn't tell me about I'm mom and to dad. Because you, you told everybody about mom and dad. Hey, hey, it's not her fault, Uncle Bullhorn. Nice. It's fine. Why are you here? I live here. Not you. you. Her. We're taking Aunt Ray shopping. Mom's upstairs giving her a wax. Yeah. Her mustache, Cameron. We're on for bowling, right? No. We're bowling. You're bowling? I'm bowling. I'm bowling. Come on, help me in the garage. <laughs> right. OK. Oh, okay. All right. OK. Don't Dad. come on. All right. All right. Kind of lined up with the door up here. Uh, Got a little trouble over there? No. <laughs> All day. Yeah, like Come on, man. So you got Ooh. the light in. You got the light. Hey, hey, Put hey. Put it down. Whitey, down. Good. A little over. over. My testicles just bounced across the room. Maybe we should get Liz in here to help out, huh? Uh, you can't do it, Cameron. Oh, hey, you're a big tough guy. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's good. Point that's at me. Good. It's good I'll you have what I want. Hey. Did you point at me? Hey. Yeah. Don't you give me the, give you the, the shocker. Hey. Don't hey. Dang. Hey. Hey. Come here. What's up? <sighs> Why? I don't want to be humiliated on purpose in front of the whole family. Everyone knows now that I live in a sexless marriage. So look, the family's not going to talk about you. They're not going to tell you. Nobody cares. Nobody oh. cares that you're oh. not having sex. I mean, we care, but we don't care that you're not. It's like, I don't Thanks wanna, a lot. I don't you don't care? You know, people bowl because they don't have sex. You bowl? You have sex? I'm I, assuming. I'm a bad bowler. I'm a bad bowler. I heard about uh, you and Colleen on the splits. I think what? that's a good idea because I felt that, that constriction. So if you want to leave her, Man, I'm all for it. I got your back. Hey, hold you it. Just hold know. it. Hold it. I'm not leaving her. I'm not going. What you, how do you know? How do you know this? How do you know that? Uh, don't confide in a four-year-old, man. My son told me. <laughs> your son? But, your son told me? I didn't confide in your hey, son. Hey, hey, if I knew I it was it. a secret, I mean, maybe maybe call me and say, hey, that's a secret. You're not supposed to know. You knowing is, is like the last vestige of hope is lost if you know. Whitey knows the secret, it's over. Well, hey, I don't want to do anything to hurt you, so I, I won't tell anybody else. I told Jose, the guy that used to work oh for you. Oh, my God. The I, lumberyard, but I, that's it. I, I, I got to tell your mother. No, no, yes. no, no. Dad, you didn't leave. You don't need to open up that can of worms, OK? I'll talk to her in a bowl. I'll tell Mom we're going to bowl. We're going to bowl. Everything's going to be good. Everything's going to be normal, OK? Mom is not going to find out. <sighs> What do you mean, Wendell's leaving me? Who told you that? Jenna. Jenna? How did Jenna know? Well, Carrie. Carrie? Who told Carrie? Sharon. Sharon, who heard it from Cameron. Cameron. Mm. Ah, Mom, yes. are you good for bowling tonight? I'm sorry to have to tell you this, uh, but it appears the colonel has been murdered. Don, can you please give it a rest? I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but it appears the colonel has been murdered. Don, can you just, can you just stop for a little while? I gotta rehearse this. I gotta learn my lines by Friday. Why don't you do it tonight? Can't tonight. We got bowling. We're not going bowling. What? Where have you been? My whole entire family knows that we're not having sex. Do you know how humiliating that is? I can't show my face around any of them. If it's about us not having sex, why don't we just have sex right now? 
That would mean a lot to me. Okay. My better yours. Just surprise me. Okay. Enter, enter. Cameron, it's Sharon. Hey, we're having sex. Uh, I mean, Don and I are in for bowling. Okay, I'll see you later. Are the checks in? Yeah, they're right there. This is the little guy, huh? Yes, this is Danny. Hey, Danny, how are you? Say hi. Hey. Good handshake. I, um, I was wondering if uh, you wanted to maybe grab coffee. Are you hitting on me? No, I just wanted to see if you wanted to grab coffee. Look, you're not my type, okay? What's your uh, type? Not you. You don't even know me. Well, I, can't, I know enough. I mean... What do you know? I don't know. I like badasses. I'm not asking you to marry me. I'm just asking for a coffee. Are you just going to keep asking? No, I won't. You can obviously, if you, if you really are just that against it, I will completely leave it alone. But I would really like to. No, you can keep asking. And you'll just keep saying no? Yeah. That's nice. <sighs> I'm sorry. It's okay. To have to tell you that the colonel has been murdered. Don! What? I have to learn him sometime. Well, that's one performance you might nail this week. I mean, was it me? Yeah. What about you? I mean, you know, it's like tossing a wrench in a closet. No offense. Yeah, none taken. Cameron sleeps with eggs. Yes. in the bed and then uh, he woke up and rolled over and, and he cracked the eggs and no the egg is an embryo okay that represents life my dad crushed life man I love a fried egg sandwich my dad sent you up here right no well yeah he did? What'd he say? And I got some cute kid clothes I have to show you that we got this year. Hey, hey, hey. Give me the lowdown. What happened? Uh, well, I, I don't think he thinks... You th you think... He, he thinks you understand him. I think, think he... I think he's... I'm understanding you less, though, Jeff. I'm understanding... And you gotta work with me a little bit. Now, now, now you didn't tell him that I sent you up there, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Why? Why? Why would you do that? Why would you tell him that? Because he he knew. He asked me. You'd have been great at the Hanoi Hilton, you know, just like, uh, we're going to hit you. I denounce America. Oh, good. Let's all go home. Let's have some rice. That may... Hi, hi, mom. Um, I, I thought you were at camp. I'm, I was at camp. I, I... Hey, 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 Cameron. You know, your son has got real honesty issues. I know. He's very honest. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, there's this guy, my assistant manager at work. Yeah. Don't say yeah like well, that me, because okay. it's much more boring. Is he, cu like, is he cute? Yeah, he's, yeah. But I like guys like, like Colin Farrell. You know, really classy. You like mean the movie star? Kind classy. Of classy. Well, classy Does bad he boy. Get women classy. pregnant and then walk away? No, he talks about them still. He doesn't walk well, away. Well, good for him, huh? I just have to take back everything I said earlier. I rewind. We're not going bowling. You called me and said that you and Don were having sex. Did you have sex? 
I shouldn't have made that call, but yes, we did have sex. And it was rotten sex. He, does he? Is he? Is he? Oh, Cameron. What is it that's not working? Do you do you love Don? Yeah, sometimes. Well, make it work with the guy. Do do something. Do like uh, do like a uh, bad student and stern schoolmaster. And... Oh, we try that. Do you know how he looks in short pants and a beanie? No, you don't. That would have turn to anyone go. off. Bowling is Whitey's thing with Danny. Cameron was saying, and I think he's right, that it would look so much better if we, as a family, as a normal family, <laughs> got together and went bowling. So this is just to cover Cameron's ass. Yes. There's no way I'm going bowling. I'm not covering up for your lies. Look, I'm begging you. For the family and for yourself, go bowling. I can't believe that he embarrassed me in front of my whole family. I am so sorry I told you. You're just taking it all wrong. I mean, for heaven's sakes, it's no great loss. You're just losing one guy. As soon as he's gone, everybody will be after you, just like in high school. You were a real trollop. <laughs> Thank God they didn't have the AIDS back then. I know what'll make you smile. Here, pull my finger. Hey, are you all right? Fine, get the shoes. What, what, what? what? Tense, please. Hey, 14. Beautiful. <clears throat> Seven. card right there. I'm a Jew and I'm saying that's a Christmas card. Yep. You think you'd ever, uh... No. You guys having fun? Yeah. Really good time. See? It's nice so to be here. Right. You were right. Okay, gosh. Do you feel... Do you feel weird? I feel really weird, like... Well, that's because you're completely imbibed. Do you, do you feel... <laughs> Why is that funny? She is. She's drunk. I feel like I'm in a Cheech and Chong movie. See those pants you were wearing during the game? Baseball pants. Mm. I like them. Jeff, it's your turn to bowl. Don't, don't move. Oh, okay. Okay. Bye. 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 Hey. Hey. Back. Nice bowling. Looks good. You saw that? So, Mom, I had a really nice talk with Cameron today, and he convinced me to come bowling. And, you know, I'm, I'm really glad I came, because when you think about it, family's all you have. Lately, we've been like two high school kids. You know, we can't keep our hands off each other. If it's you could great. be, if you could be, if you had like a free pass to be with like any woman besides your wife. Who would it be? I don't know. I, I have a lot of thoughts about Liz, to be honest, but uh, I'd rather not talk about it with you. What the hell? No, no, no. I mean that as a compliment. She's beautiful. She's she's just... I don't know. I don't want to come out and just say it, though. You, you just did. Oh, I guess I did. Damn me. Ah, Zebro and d Dog. What's up, man? Hey, either one of you guys want to bet me five bucks see I can uh, chug this beer? No. No. Can either one of you guys just give me some five bucks? Get it? Awesome. All I just right, got the new stop. high score on Racer 3000. You guys want to go check it out? That's cool. What? Have a seat. Come on, have a seat. Thanks. What? Oh, this is Henry. Yeah. Hey, Sweet. I, I've so seen you at school before. I think he's the kid who threw up in the lunchroom last week. Excuse Fine. me, Jen. No, no. So, I think Henry's he's, he's my cousin. Cool gene pool. <laughs> Excuse me, ladies. I'm sorry. Both of you are beautiful. Yes. Thanks. Now, and I enjoy hanging out with you because you're beautiful. But when you're ugly on the inside, it makes you ugly on the outside. So you girls are like the ugly duckling that never became the goose. Swan, Jeff. <laughs> Good point. You know what? I like basketball better than baseball anyways. So I yeah. really thought you were cooler than this. Okay, cool. Go dye your hair. Mm, All catch right? you later. Okay. Bye, bye Farah. Bye. Yeah, bye, guys. Farah. Looks like a duck. Thanks, Jeff. <laughs> your family. You want a lemonade? Did they drink it? Yeah. Sweet. <laughs>
Oh, Dick Lane told me a funny one the other day. How do you get an elephant out of the theater? You can't. It's in their blood. I think I want to call you Wendell. No, I don't, I don't think Grandpa is just right right now. Sure. Yeah. Wendell. Yeah. Wendell's cool. So Wendell. Uh -huh. What's this with you like leaving Grandma? You know, sometimes the opposite of one profound truth is another profound truth. It's like a paradox, you know, so... Cut the crap, Wendell. You, you got some other girl? You got something going on on the side? <laughs> Listen, I love you, Grandma. And I love you. And I'm just a guy trying to figure it out here. Whatever. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll call you Grandpa. Okay. Grandpa's good. Mom, what's up? There's something wrong, all right? Why don't you just, just talk to people? Why, Cameron, what could possibly be wrong? Of course there's nothing wrong. Mom, why do you have to be so passive-aggressive? Why don't you just say what's on your mind? Fine. Okay, you know what? We're gonna stop this little charade right now. Wendell, I know that you're thinking about leaving me. Obviously, everybody knows you're thinking about leaving me. You all do, every one Mom. of you. Mom. No, be quiet and listen to me. You just make a mockery of all of this by sharing it behind my back. What do you want from me? I have given you the best years of my life and some great sex. Shame on you. Shame on all of you for doing this to me. This is all your fault, Cameron. I don't think we need to be calling out blame here. Who's to blame? Even it's though it's you. Fault. Yeah, no, you should have known not. I didn't even know. You should have known not. No, Trust me, Cameron. You're the one. Well, you started the whole thing. He started the whole thing. I'm lonely. Me too, Don. What do you say we sleep together tonight? Like, no sex? Yeah. I smell vinegar. It's my face scrub. It's strong. So strong I could eat french fries off your face. over to apologize to mom. I wouldn't do that. I, I tried it already. That's why I'm in the van. I'd wait until tomorrow. Dad, don't sleep out here, please. This is all my fault. Come over and stay at our place. No, no, I, I, the van, this is so... It's creepy in here, Dad, and it's cold. This looks like one of those vans that guys drive around and, and, and they snatch women off the <laughs> sidewalk and never see them again. It smells, Dad. I drove 300 miles with a dead elk in this bed once. <laughs> I still smell the elk, Dad. I wasn't <laughs> sure what it was. You just nailed it. That's dead elk. Do you think we could bottle it and make a... Yeah, like Chanel number two. <laughs> I think maybe it's just this bedroom. Maybe we should try doing it somewhere else. Like, you know, like in the kitchen or... I don't know, in the backyard. Yeah. Pike's Peak. Or what about on a pirate ship? Oh, a pirate ship, yeah. I would really like a pirate ship. Oh, I'd like to hold a parrot while I just take you to town. What about on a bus? 
Oh, like a bus full of yeah. old people. Chocolate covered They were bus. all blind, so they didn't even know what we were doing. Oh, yeah. And they'd just... be like, what's that noise? What's that noise, oh, Ira? Oh, confuse the hell out of old people. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I like this. I yeah. do, too. I, I like fantasizing with you. I know, it's fun. It looks like we used to. Yeah, back in the old days. When you had the band. Before the mortgages. Mm-hmm. Taxes. Depression. Anger. Cable. I'm sorry, Dad. I mean, it would have been better if you hadn't said anything. It would have been even better if I hadn't said anything. Out of all this, the thing I wish the most is that Aunt Ray had had a stroke yesterday. I don't know how Mom's going to forgive any of us. Did you see? I mean, that was crazy. That was crazy. God, she was hurt. And she didn't deserve it. No, she didn't. Danny. Danny. 